So, I came home from school today, and I thought I'd go for a run, because exercise is always good, <clears throat> exercise is always good, right? And I was going to put on Pokemon Go, because I had an egg that was nearly done. I think I have a second one. Yeah. It's at 1.8 kilometers, and um, I was surprised to find out, find these uh, Pokemon on the map. And I was more surprised to see a Murkrow spawn directly on my house. So, I just uh, I just found out, I know it happened last night, but Gen 2 for Pokemon Go was released. So, my previous video plan definitely will not be going through. Here's a spinner rack. I've gotten a few of these. There's a lot around here. Let's just get this guy. Oh, God. That's a pretty strong one. Let's do Ultra Ball. Um, yeah, as you can see, there's more berries, and I'll get onto that after I catch this guy. And I did, I didn't do a, a big run today, because I had some homework to do. But I did catch a lot of new uh, Gen 2 Pokemon. There's about 80 released in this update, I believe. So I'll just go through the ones that I've caught. And my video plan for this. First, let's go through the update. From what I understand, uh, as you can tell by the Pokedex, um, there are a lot of Pokemon added into the game. Several from this next gen. And there's all, like 80 plus, I think, what I read on Forbes. Which is amazing. So there's a lot more in the game. Hopefully it'll bring more players back in. Put this game back on um, on the market and stuff like that. Um, but um, that's pretty much the gist of Gen 2. It's got all Gen 2 Pokemon in there as far, as far as I'm concerned. Um, If I click on my profile, there's more badges. There's badges for... There's separate badges for the Kanto, Le uh, the Kanto region and the Johto region. I've registered 14 from the Johto region. It's pretty good. I'm making some progress there. And there's, I think there's some more badges. I maybe I can check. That's just Pokemon. What am I doing? Um, let's see. Uh, I'm not seeing much. Oh yeah, there's dark. There's dark type one. I don't remember if that one was in there. This fighting, we've had that. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's any new types or anything like that. But yep. Yeah, um, now let's go and move to the Pokemon. We'll just go hover over. One Pokemon that gets, I know you saw that ferret, um, just hover over the Pokemon that I think best illustrates everything that's going on, if I can find him, there he is, I got this guy recently, um, so, as you can see from the evolve button down below, if the honors will load, um, there's now, it shows the next evolution, and it shows how many candies are needed, and this little symbol right here. And pretty much this symbol just tells you that you get this symbol, you get this item from a Pokestop. And it's a very rare chance I have not gotten anything. Hopefully I'll get something tomorrow. But, whoops. Um, but yeah, that means basically you need 50 candies, you need one of those items. A lot of Pokemon have this. I know um, Gloom have it. I think I have a Gloom up here. Let's see. Yeah, I've got a Gloom right here. You can evolve to a... Shoot... Bellossom, I think is the name of the that evolution. Um, I need to refresh myself on Gen 2 Pokemon. Um, but yeah, before I go into Pokemon that I've caught since the last update video, I want to go over the new berries that have been added. Um, these are the only two I've seen so far. There's a Nanab berry, and it calms a Pokemon do down, um, which makes, pretty much from what I understand, it makes it so it'll just stay in the same place, which is pretty good. And a Panop berry, which is makes it drop more candy, which can be very, very helpful later on. I am really low on uh, Pokeballs now because there's been so many around here. Um, yeah, as you can see, there's a lot of Lediba and Spinarax and Centrus around me. I don't know if it's because I'm in a rural area or anything to do with that. But I don't think I've shown you all my Charmeleon, which I just recently got out in Raleigh. Uh, let's see if there's any new ones. I've shown you all these. Uh, we'll just go through all the new Pokemon, including, well, excluding the ones from this gen, I suppose. I got this Chansey a few days ago. Um, not in Raleigh, but I got it from an egg. Um, pretty good. Oh, it's got an evolution now. Forgotten that. That's in gen. I forgot that was in gen 2. I think it's Blissey. If I'm correct. Um, got a lot of health. Um, got that from a 10 kilometer egg. Let's see. Uh, Charmeleon I got from near Pokestop in Raleigh. It's pretty good, Charmeleon. Um, I think 
I haven't showed you Tentacruel. Forgot about him. I got him for my buddy. I had a lot of candy saved up. He's pretty cool. Water poison type. I don't think he's going to load, but I'm sure y'all know what he... Yeah, that's what he looks like. Pretty cool. Um, any other guys? Any new ones? I think I'm showing you Arbok. Uh, oh, yeah, Scyther gets an evolution now. i to tell you that. Which is pretty cool. I think I'm showing you Seal. Um... That looks like all the ones I got. I got this uh, Clefairy. I don't remember if I showed you all this. I'm pretty sure I did. But just in case I forgot to. Falls into a uh, Clefable, I believe. I just froze a little bit. Let's go start from the... No, we'll start from the bottom. I'll show you all the new Pokemon I've gotten from this gen. So I got this one a few, about, let's say about an hour ago, Chikorita, who's the grass starter. I, he was just randomly going around. Uh, no, it's got gender. Oh, the gender is in now, so it's she. And Chikorita is the grass starter for the Johto League. She evolves into Bayleaf, and then Meganium, I believe, is the final evolution. I got this Hoot Hoot a few hours ago when I was out on my run. Evolves into Noctowl. He... Um, he, they're, they're not, they're kind of common. I'd say they're uncommon. Whoops. I haven't, I've seen two. That's about it. Um, start all the way back down. Come on. Let's see the, what's the next one? <coughs> Excuse me. Yanma, I just saw this one a few hours ago. They're not very common. Um, hopefully I'll find a better one because this one's pretty low on CP. Small though, but I like this Pokemon. Pretty cool. Um, I got a Sunkern, which evolves into Sunflora, I believe. Um, they're pretty common. I see them all around. I got 14 candies already. And yeah, not much to say about this guy. He's kind of average. I got this guy, the Remoraid, uh, about 30 minutes ago. He evolves into an Octillery. They're not very common. But there is a lake in many Let me see. There's a well. There's supposed to be a lake. There's not really a lake there, but they think there is, and that's where a lot of the water Pokemon spawn. And as you can see from those Pokey stops, and click on it. I can't click on it right now, but the, I went there today and I got a few. I got that's where I got the berries and items like that. Um, <clears throat> I could scroll down. I'm gonna show you that fur. I'm I'm glad I got that fur though. I love that full evolution, so I don't have to evolve anybody. Um, Centrit. Centrit, I got. Uh, I've seen these guys all over the place. Um, they evolve into Furret. who already got one up, so I'm not gonna collect many of these unless I can find a a good chance to get a better fur because fur Centrit and Furret are kind of one of my favorite normal types. Um, oh, I didn't show Hopip. Hoppip's one of my favorite grass Pokemon. Just mainly because it got a lot of evolutions and it just looks kind of cool, in my opinion. Um, there's been a few around. There's not, they're not insanely common, but uh, I've gotten, as you can see, I've got two. They evolve into uh, a jump bluff? No, what's the, the second? I don't remember the second evolution. I think the final evolution is a jump bluff or something like that. Wooper, who I believe falls into Wobbuffet or a Quagsire. Um, I got one of these guys, he was at a Pokestop, at my local cemetery, and he's pretty big, he's pretty cool, he's bopping around, um, but yeah, another Hopip, Spinarak, have I shown Spinarak yet? I have not, yeah, Spinarak's been showing all over the place, I've already got 22 candies on this guy, there's a lot of Spinaraks around. Um, Luddy Buzz the same. Not as much, but there's a good amount of Ladybos and Ladians around. Uh, who else? Murkrow, I've only seen one. This was the, actually the first Pokemon of the Johto League for me to catch. Oh, more Spinarax. I think there's only one more. Who is... I got this Oddish. I got this War Turtle. I think I showed you all that. I got this Oddish today from an egg. I was disappointed. I got this Slowpoke. Amazing CP that I can get to a slow king. Ooh, she can evolve it from a slow poke. You, from a slow poke, if you've got that item, you can slip the slow bro. Oh, I didn't know that. That's cool. 
Um, I got this ferret on my way back from my run today. And he's pretty, pretty strong. But I'm not very big fan of the normal types. He's got hyper beam though, which could be very helpful. And I, I would like to get a um, Johto League. A, I like a high uh, CP Johto League Pokemon just to scare people in gyms. Um, another small minor cosmetic. I need to check. How are you doing? Looks okay. Needs four more. Uh, another small cosmetic update is the style. Which, um, you can just, there's a few options here. Let me click, I think, uh, hats, best illustrated this. You can have pay options if you got any coins, and you have some freebies and stuff like that. You can unlock some, I think you can, in tops. Yeah, this one's unlocked, or is locked. I don't know how you unlock it. But that's pretty much it for this update. I might do daily updates. I'll go out, if I get anything new tomorrow, which I most likely will, um, I'll, I'll update y'all on that, and... And that, that's it for this video. It's kind of a long yeah, all right, video. Um, subscribe if you're not already subscribed. Like the video to show your support. It's always pre appreciated. And as always, I will see y'all next time.